Hello. We're going to do um, a review on Battle Valley today, which I thought on the Commodore 64 version was absolutely brilliant in every way. Bit of, bit, of, bit of an odd game really to play and quite a long, very long winded game as we're going to start off in the tank. Oops. I've got the double fire mode on so what that does you push the fire button twice and it turns the tank so you can go the other direction or whatever just slows you down. It's, we've got about four different speeds on this. Oh, sometimes you push it by accident when you're firing. You do like I'm doing now, you're firing away, push it too quick, you um, turn the tank around. Good graphics I think. Yeah, I think it is. Nice, nicely um, animated with the tank, with the uh, backgrounds. And once again, I've done an Amstrad review on this game, and the Amstrad view, um, game of this, Battle Valley, or the Amstrad version I should just say, was a total piece of shit. And this, this Commodore 64 version so much nicer to play much more smoother, much more going on with the graphics actually the background moves where, where the Amstrad didn't very buggy with the Amstrad so that was rushed to get out where this was taking time over very good game to play Oh well, it's too much damage there. Waffling on, you know, telling you about the game. Well, that's my problem, really. I just waffle on about the game and don't play the game, really. Oh, now it's, I think it's time to take the helicopter out. So we'll, basically, what you do with the tank, you clear a path for the helicopter so the helicopter doesn't have to do so much firing at things, you know, use the tank. Oh, got hit there. My damage, no. No problem. Yeah, the tank's role is to clear all this, and the helicopter's job is just to um, fly in. And put the bridge up. Here we go. Here's the bridge, or the bridge part, girder, whatever it is. So what we do? Get our winch out. Here we go. Find it. F. Yeah. My F3. Get the winch out, yeah, get the winch out. So then we've got to line it up. Oh, right Should have used took the fire button, the double fire mode off and used the space bar. It'd been a hell of a lot of e easier. There we go, place that down there. And we'll go back. The object of the game I think is to take over two or three um, bases, I think you Take the bases over, and then you've got to destroy a missile either side. This is two or three bases, either left and right, and a missile each side. As I say, this, I've never completed this. It's a good game, I think, really good game. But as I say, it is quite a long winded game. Doing the same thing over and over again can get a bit boring. It's a good go, apart from that, and the helicopter. And we're going to take our tank out again, so now we can cross the bridge. Then we get um, a base, we capture a base. As I say, we do that, there's two or three more. Two more after that, or one more, I don't know, I don't really remember. I tend to do, try and do one side, then the other side. Yeah, I believe the game's good. Right on the tank, you've got, you've got full speeds on that. And I remember doing that on the Amstrad, there were so many bugs in it. Trying to go across the bridge, it blew up. The fucking thing, the fucking tank blew up. Trying to cross it, so it was definitely bugs. Horrible bugs with the game. So here we are, we captured the base. Oh, gone a bit too far there. Line it, put it on that little platform thing there, and 
flag goes down, your other helicopters and tanks turn up. And looks like the England flag. So could it be the Falklands? <laughs> no. So um, here we go again. So we go and do basically got to do the same thing again now. Oh, the fire mode button get a bit annoying. So basically, yeah, I'm do exactly the same thing. Go and capture another boat. No, build another, put another bridge in. Stop here, get some more ammo. Oops. Yeah, get some ammo. Get some more shells for your um, tank. You can do it with the helicopter. There's a thing that you can get the winch out and um, get more weapons. But uh, you waste your time so much with that because you're on the time limit. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was close. So we go back again. And get the helicopter. So basically, that's all you do. Get your tank out. Oh, I might get that if I can. Oh, fuck it. Oh, it's going over go. Sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake, I can't get the fucking food. Yeah. Fucking time. It's only because I keep pushing it. Buttons. Yeah. Just gotta, uh, you know, fool your way. Oh, bollocks. Yeah. I'm really concentrating so much on talking away. There we go. I don't know why you got two tanks there. You only use one of them, not the helicopter. You only use one. Don't ever use the other one. What's the point of it? There we go, we've done to our winching and build and our bridge repair system. Bri bi bridge repair operation, I'd say. I mean, that's all the helicopter's good for. I think that's all it does, is the bridge repair. Unless it does anything else, I don't know. I ain't going to bother with that. But it's the same thing over and over again. Oh. crashed then. Shit. You know, I'm just going to end the review here because, you know, it's the same thing all the time. Hope you enjoyed it. That's the end. Goodbye.